Hey guys, it's Natalie Alyssa and I am back for another takeover today and I am really excited about this one. I'm going to be answering a question that I do get asked a lot, which is how you even take an outfit of the day picture. So I'm gonna go through my best tips and tricks and share it all with you guys. So my first tip is definitely to get ready and make yourself feel confident and make yourself feel good. Um, so whether it's doing your makeup, I like to wear hair extensions. So I'm gonna show you guys the makeup products that I use and the hair extensions that I use as well. So for my hair extensions, I do use the Luxie hair extensions and these are the chestnut brown 220 gram. I do need the thickest one because I have really thick hair, but I absolutely love these. They look so seamless and natural and great in your photos. So all of the makeup products that I just showed are what I'm wearing right now. And I do like to keep it really natural, just with a hint of color. I find it just shoots better on camera, so I usually like to keep it this way. Before I move on, I just wanted to mention this lip color because literally I wear this probably in every shoot. I probably need to go get a new one, but it's the Velvet Teddy Matte MAC Lipstick. And it's such a beautiful, like, everyday color. So if you guys watched my last takeover, I talked about saving photos of outfits that inspire you or even different poses that you want to try out. It's so much easier to go into it knowing kind of what you want to go for. So I've been really inspired by a lot of looks that have combat boots. So I did get a pair. I got these ones here and I absolutely love them. They have a really chunky heel and the big buckle is really cool. All right, so this is the final look. I have the grid jacket, the turtleneck, I have black jeans and the boots. So I'm just gonna put it on and make sure that it looks how I'm hoping it will. Okay, so I do have my outfit on, but before we go out and take pictures, I do wanna talk about posing because I feel like that's a big question that I get asked is, how do you pose? I feel so awkward when I pose. So I'm gonna show you my biggest trick. Okay, so this blogger, Carly Christman. I watched this video a year ago and I have kept her poses in mind ever since. She has this amazing video on how to look good in every picture and what poses to do. I swear you guys have to watch. said, I feel like there's so many different tips on what to wear, how to pose, everything. And in the end, you just need to do you and do what feels comfortable. I wrote a new blog post about that and how to feel motivated and confident through your clothing and what you wear. So definitely go and check that out on the website. All right, so I'm outside, ready to take a picture, and thankfully it is really nice out, which is very rare, obviously, in the winter here in Toronto, so I am happy. And I will show you guys all of my tips. All right guys, so I'm already back home from my shoot and as you can see, it really doesn't need to be anything crazy. I think it took us maybe like 20 minutes to take the picture and now I'm going to edit them and yeah. I also wanted to mention that I take all of my pictures on my iPhone. I used to use a DSLR, but honestly I find that iPhone takes photos so much easier and captures those in-between moments. And as soon as I switched to iPhone, it was way better. So yeah, that's basically how I take my outfit of the day photos. I hope these tips and tricks have helped you guys and maybe you guys will start using some of them to take your photos. So I am really happy I was able to share. If you have any more questions about how I take my photos, be sure to follow me, natalie.alyssa, or just DM me. I will be sure to answer you. And I am looking forward to my next takeover with you guys. I hope you have a great Friday.